Let me review another important video term in this movie, frame size. Conventional television screens are made up of horizontal lines, while computer monitors consist of a series of horizontal and vertical pixels. The standard line resolution for an NTSC television set is 525 lines. For PAL, it's 576 lines. However, most modern computer monitors have much higher vertical resolutions. These are measured in pixels, such as 768 or 1024. This requires vertical upscaling during playback in order to fill the computer monitor. For NTSC video images, the SMPTE 259M professional standard specifies that the 525 lines be represented as 720 by 486, that is, 720 horizontal pixels by 486 vertical pixels. This default video size is commonly known as D1, capturing footage with modern video capture cards from professional beta SP or digital beta cam source results in a D1 sized frame. However, capturing footage from a DV, which is a digital video source, however, yields a 720 by 480 pixel frame. The difference between the D1 spec and the DV spec is only six vertical pixels. So many compression algorithms including DV compression, work best with pixel dimensions that are multiples of 16. By removing six pixels from the D1 resolution, the DV format achieves a native resolution with a multiple of 16. That's the reason why a lot of video compression works better, and in terms of video scaling as well, works better if the pixel dimensions are multiples of 16. For PAL video images, frames are always 720 by 576 pixels, regardless of the video source. Because PAL's vertical resolution, 576, is a multiple of 16 already, no change is necessary for DV compression. Let me now move on to another important video term, frame rate, which will be the topic of the next movie.